Welcome to Shark Friend 101 here and welcome back. I am very excited. I'm sorry this reaction is so late, but originally when I tried to sit down to watch this reaction, I accidentally watched the episode ahead of this episode and I was like, I can't do them out of order. I have to do them in order even though there is no continuity actually in this series, but I, I feel like for my own peace of mind, I need to do it the right way. So, if you haven't seen the title or read the thumbnail, today we're watching Season 1, Episode 7 of Home Movies, and I am very excited. I have no background of what this episode's about. I just know it's called It's Supposed to Be Funny, so I don't know if we're going to make jokes that were supposed to be funny and we actually ended up hurting somebody, or if we're going to make jokes that are supposed to be funny and just aren't funny. So, which would be very possible with Jason or Brennan, frankly, because sometimes they make a joke and it just, just doesn't land. So sit back, grab a snack, and enjoy my first time watching Season 1, Episode 7 of Home Movies. Also, I would like to formally apologize to the person in the comments who let me know that I've been saying H. John Benjamin's name wrong this entire time. I was re-watching one of my videos the other day, and I keep realizing that I'm saying John H. Benjamin, and someone in the comments was like, hey, it's H. John Benjamin. And I just now put together how many times I've said John H. Benjamin. So I formally apologize. I, I'm a fake fan. Okay, for this scene, mm -hmm. we got to focus on emotion. On right. motivation. Emotion. Melissa, you look great. Thank you. Yeah, but you don't feel great. <laughs> you look great. Okay. Forlorn, you look great. Jason. Do I look great? No, no, you you look forlorn. I don't feel forlorn. Jason, you're playing the part of Randy, and Randy is forlorn. Brendan. Yeah. Um, is this forlorn? <laughs> no, actually, <laughs> oh, no, forlorn. About this. <laughs> <laughs> what are you doing? That's forlorn not a sad, farmer. Jason, you, you got it. How about this? <laughs> <laughs> oh, you're a dog. Melissa. Yeah. How do you yep. spell sophisticated? Um. <clears throat> okay, it's like sophisticated. Eight. Whoa, 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 slow down. Take it one letter at a time. Okay, S that's literally me, because every time I ask someone how to spell something, they go so fast, and I'm like, okay, I you need a minute. Saying. Sophisticated. S-O-S-Y. You don't have to do that spelling bee crap. It's just the way that I know how to spell it. But in reality, you don't have to say words before you say them. Like, I don't have to say, say, every, every word, twice, twice. All right? All right? Okay. You did it again, Melissa. I'm sorry. Leave her alone. word. Um, I can't do it without saying it. Come on. S O F. All right, S O F. I S T I T E. Right. D. C. Oh, I thought it was over. D. Say, what are you doing? D. And then another D at the end. Two Ds at the end. Does it look right with two Ds? No. One D. God. An eraser. Okay. Yeah. Well, just read it, please. Okay. Handsome, sophist, so handsome. Sophisticated, Melissa. Oh, right. Oh, handsome, right. Handsome, sophisticated man enjoys fine wine and lots of it. Yeah, I love that. Seeks beautiful woman for long walks. That's really sweet, Coach McGurk. I changed it from enjoys alcohol. It sounds nicer. I changed now I have to boil down my whole alcohol. personality in one huge lie. You did a good job. I saw it on Saturday. Brother, I think I'm available maybe even mm. next Saturday. Okay, you know, I'm only actually interested in uh, this. Actually, uh, Brendan, I can't make it. Well, what, do you, what do you mean uh, you can't make it? Well, I'm going to visit my grandfather in the nursing home. Aww. Do you have to go? No, but I like visiting him. I mean, yeah. he's really old, but he's really nice. For your own sake, do not go because, you know, it's not healthy for you to be hanging around with old people because oh God, you, know, you could Brennan. catch an old person's disease and uh, suddenly become old. Brennan, Brennan shut up. A myth. You'd like my grandfather. He's a great storyteller. Mm, do you know Titanic? Right. Yeah, of course I do. He saw the original movie. <laughs> well, that's oh my it. Yeah. My, uh, my, Brendan, my grandfather calls me Debbie and tries to kiss me. He does what? No. My grandfather was um, a surgeon and lost a big male practice suit because he cut off the wrong leg. That's awful. It's, God. It's terrible, Jason. What are you doing? I'm talking to you. I have an idea. Mm -hmm. so actually a proposition. I'm listening. Okay. Do you want to do a documentary about my grandfather? I'm, uh, I'm not listening. No, I don't. Why? Know. I, Melissa, I don't do documentaries. How come? Because I don't. Oh, uh, I see. You don't do them because they're too hard. What? I will do your documentary. She's your playing mind games. Will, because as a director, I don't want to be pigeon-toed. All right? You mean pigeonholed? Yes. So you'll do it? Yeah, of, of course I will. Okay, good. Because here's the best part. 
My father said that he'll pay you because he wants to show the video at my grandfather's 75th birthday party next Real week. money. Hey, spending money? Mm-hmm. For doing what I love to do? Yep. Th throw a number out, you know. Ten? That sounds great. Okay. Ten what? Right. Ten dollars an hour or ten dollars in general? I already hung up. Oh. Brendan? Boo, boo, boo. Being creative. Oh, oh my gosh. It's a car, not a couch. Come on, you old fart. It's a car, oh, not a couch. <laughs> yeah. Come on, Gramps. Let's go. Move it. Yeah. Oh, oh, gosh. Oh. Yeah. He has such road rage. Gramp, move. Move it. Move it. Thank you. Oh. Thank you. Ah. Go. Uh, oh, Mom. We have so much fun on our car rides, don't we? Mm. Hey, I'm excited about this video recording project. Grandpa is really... He's gonna love it. Okay. Or hate it. Or He's hate gonna it. react. Okay. Two kids cheeseburgers and one adult. Two small fries. Yes. Small fries. Okay. No, forget the small fries. It's Mom, one large. No. Two small orange sodas. Mom, Mom, I want my own fries. No, oh, we're gonna no. split it. Mom. Two small orange sodas and a large. Mom, I want my own. You never finish your own fries. It's a waste of food and money. No, you, but no, but someday I'm gonna finish them, Mom, and today could be that day. You know. You too. You feel it, Mom. Come on. Yeah, mom. See, mom. Even the speaker guy says I should have my own fries, and he does this for a living. True. No, he does. He does this for a living. He fries all day. He knows. No, mom, he knows fries. How about I handle my kids, okay, Mister? Just trying to help. How's your cheeseburger, Brendan? Is that what this is supposed to be? Funny. How are those fries coming? <laughs> out? Um, I don't know what you're talking I, about. I think I still see some fries there. Well, I, I um, can't uh, finish them. Thank you for asking. Why can't you? Because there the are too many. Oh, oh darn! Too many fries, huh? You just can't finish your own fries. Um, oh my gosh, this I episode to bring is really my good. Bag of I told you so's. You got a new bag of I told you so's? Yeah. Remind me to give you a great big fat bag of I told you so's when we get home, okay, Brendan? Mom, we hardly have enough money for fries, and you're like spending money on bags of I told you so's. Okay. Al Steele came into my office. He said to me, "Kennedy has been shot," mm -hmm. and I saw a tear rolling down his cheek. He was okay. crying. So, please. this sucks. The yeah, this is so is boring. Is Melissa's dad's going to ask for his money back, and yeah, I've already spent it, and he hasn't oh, even Freddy. paid me yet. You know, it's very educational. I think. It is. Uh, so's a book. You know, I, I, I can't so have my book. name attached to something like this. But, but Brendan, it's what Melissa wants. I bet I can make it better, Jason. No, let's puppy. not take creative liberty, please. <laughs> Grandpa, let's man. not. Hey. Hey, Captain. Brennan. I can take it. Hey, wake up. Hey. Hey, how are you? Oh. <gasps> To the left. Over to the left. Okay. How about that? Oh, Brennan, this is left. really in poor taste because the rest of her family is going to watch this and it's going to be in really poor taste. This is a bad idea. To the radio. <laughs> Tell me about that. <laughs> it's not. Okay, oh, no. Here is the guest of honor. Everybody sing. Happy. Happy. Dad. Hey, Dad, we're, we're, we're gonna watch. We're gonna watch the video now. <gasps> oh yes, Aww. Brendan, will you do the honors? Yeah. Um, everyone, uh, please focus your attention to the uh, the please TV. Don't, please don't. Please. It was 1938. We were listening to the radio. We always listened to the radio because TV wasn't born yet. Mm -hmm. I was. The radio in the 1930s. It was the size of a refrigerator. And everybody loved the radio. Brennan. I love you, radio. I'm a little teapot short. Brennan. Jason, what did you do to the video, Jason? Brennan, I am so... Melissa, don't even... You look so angry right now. This is yeah, perfect. I wish I had a camera up. because of where, where, where are you going? <sighs> so what did Melissa say about me? Is she, is she still mad at me? Oh, she I would says think she so, was yes. upset because you made pottery out of her grandfather. Pottery. What does Pondering. that mean? Pottery, like a vase or a... Okay, are you are you sure she didn't say mockery? Mom, I don't know. I didn't know what word he was trying to that. say. Uh, yeah, because um, you did make a mockery of her grandpa's yes, birthday. Yes, she did. Well, I mean, I guess. I... But she said pottery. I don't think she said pottery. Well, it was supposed to be funny, you know, it's, but but it, poignant funny. I mean, I I didn't really mean to make fun of the guy, but but it was so easy. There's two kinds of funny, Brendan, right? Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. There's mean funny, which is you know when you make fun of someone yeah. right. and get laughs at their expense. You know, like stuffing that nerdy kid in the locker. What's his name? Uh, Brian. Carlo, the Italian kid. Oh right, Carlo. With a funny accent. That's funny too. Accents are funny. Shut okay, up. Yeah, but I don't see how that's gonna help. I mean. Then there's nice funny, like maybe okay. a little uh, light sarcasm or a clever yeah. twist or a knock knock joke. I like those. You like those? And what you did to Melissa's grandfather was mean funny, Brendan. Okay. Putting a wig and a makeup on some old man while he's sleeping. Yeah, yeah. but I mean, put lipstick on him. 
Yeah. You did? Yeah, I, I That's did. good. Yeah. Did you push the call button or do the bad thing where, you know, it went up and down? He's in pretty bad shape. We didn't, uh, no, we didn't impair his uh, health. Oh. No. That's how my grandfather died. You know, actually, uh, Coach, okay. it, Melissa's mad at me about yeah. the whole thing. Well, you know what? All you gotta do is make it up to her. Okay, but but how? You know, <laughs> usually I just say I'm sorry. Yeah, well, I mean, that could work. Or you give someone money. <laughs> Dad? Yeah. What are you doing? Wait. Is he sad or is he laughing? You were laughing. You're right. But it, it's funny. A 75 year old man in drag. What's not to like? But aren't you mad at Brendan? Uh, well, he may have gone a little too far, but I don't think he was being malicious, Melissa. Boy, say well, that no, three times but... Fast. Don't be taken in by his boyish charm. It's gonna take more than balloons and flowers for me to forgive you, Brendan Small. Well, b uh, both names. Oh, she snatched it, though. <laughs> Can I get that for you, ma'am? That's man. Lady. That's man. man. <laughs> Let me help you with that. Oh. <gasps> Whoops. Oh, Girl. Hey, Butterfingers. Brendan, let's go. <laughs> it's not me! My mom did it! Brendan. Brendan. That was real nice of you to help him, Mom. The elderly should be treated with respect. Yeah, but not all the time, right? Always. Yeah, then, yeah, but um, you said they were old farts. Brendan, I never said that. Yes, you did. That might have might have hurt somebody's feelings. An old person's feelings? What makes you say that? Just a guess. No, it's Melissa. Well, did you apologize? Yes, I did. In fact. Well, that's good. And? She's still mad. Uh, okay. Well, you know what you could do? What? Flowers and candy. Yeah. I did that. did that. Oh, both. Yeah, Re reenactment of Melissa's grandfather's life. It David, don't use your hands. This is not tennis. I, I, I can keep uh, some of the his narration, but intercut it with new scenes and. David, and <clears throat> soccer, no hands. Coach, I mean, he saved a guy's life in the war, and you know that's what I want to show. David, right. I'm gonna come out there and cut those off. Yeah. You got it, David. It's just a new. Uh, What's the stupid look for? That kid's got to learn. Just yeah. getting roasted. That's the basic rule. I, I, I need someone big and strong to play the lead role. And uh, Lead role? Yeah. You thinking of me for the lead? I believe, yeah. Well, I'll do it, but on one condition. Okay, whatever, anything. Right. <clears throat> yeah, I, I, um, I didn't hear what you said. I couldn't think of anything to say. Hmm. David, <laughs> I'll cut them off! No, <laughs> save this for the, for the... Think about it, your life with no hands! I mean, uh, uh, okay, everybody ready? Speaking yeah, jerk. You guys ready? Uh, yeah. Okay. All right, and action. Okay, wait, wait one more, uh, one yeah. more question. Okay, cut, 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 Why did you? Yeah. What is my motivation in this scene? Yeah, it's you're to be quiet. Really you're you what he says. Yeah. Okay. I'm gonna breathe through my nose during this scene. Is that all right with you? Yeah. Whatever makes you comfortable, man. That sounds great. Okay. Okay. Cut. I mean, uh, action. Action. Come, uh, come back here, German, German. <laughs> I'll save you, soldier. Hey, that's some deep breathing. <laughs> Don't worry. What the hell is going on? Hey, who's worried? <laughs> You're Ned. <laughs> better mm -hmm. Ned than dead. Right. <laughs> but better still, <laughs> never Ned. It's not supposed to be funny, and it is. <laughs> Wait a minute, hold up, hold up. Up. Okay. What's this guy doing here? Let's start you guys off again, uh, McGurk. Okay. I don't know, maybe if right, you... So you want me to pull back on the nose breathing. Right. Yes, don't breathe so loud. Ready and, uh, action. Ah, oh, Brendan, I forgot my line. Okay. Let's just say, come back here. All right, come back here. Okay. Come back here. Right. I'll save you, soldier. Don't worry. Hey, who's worried? You're, you're Ned, one of the best soldiers around. Thank you, Ned, for saving my life. You're welcome, <laughs> soldier. <laughs> okay, cut. Great. Perfect. That was, that was great, guys. Thank you, Ned, for saving my life. Yeah, you know, Eric, uh, we cut. We're, we stopped rolling. I was going to say we're oh, cut. You guys did fantastic. We can stop. All right, Brendan, can we do my thing now? Yeah, you know, that's that's fine. Jesus. Hmm. <clears throat> I uh, am a professional soccer coach at the mm. uh, elementary school level, mm. and I, uh, I own a nice car, though I do not currently have legal access to it. Uh, okay. As you can see, I used to be in good shape, and uh, in the last two years, I've successfully completed four out of five rehab programs. Okay. The kind of woman I'm interested in is the one, uh, I guess, who's still watching this video. <laughs> this oh. is my proudest moment, the birth of my granddaughter, Melissa. So, uh, uh, what did you what did you think, Melissa? I think you just don't get it, do you, Brendan? I mean... What? Oh, whoa. <laughs> what? <laughs> I'm just kidding. I thought it was really good. I really Aww. liked it, Brendan. Thanks. Um, um. Dad? It, that was the biggest piece of... <gasps> Dad? Oh, um, how long was I 
your sleep. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Dad! Whoa, I feel like I've been hit by a truck. Um. Dad? He's flatlining a lot. Burning toast. Um. Who keeps touching me? I can't. Huh. Dad, I gotta I got hit the road here. This is not. What are we doing? We gotta get out of here. Who's killing this party? Everyone's leaving. Uh, I'd, I'd like a, a you know tall woman uh, about my height. Ew, Jason. My ideal woman is my mother, actually. Ew. Who I hate. No, let's I not. I need a nice young woman to cut my toenails. I'm looking for a woman who will accept me for who I am and not for my money. Although <laughs> I'll, g I'll give you fifty dollars. <laughs> Gosh. Okay, so that was really that was really funny. I enjoyed that episode a lot. Um, I I it kind of bothered me that like okay, so maybe it's just me, but like I was kind of on Melissa's side that they really did kind of distasteful trying to make a joke out of like when they did the first take. Um, and so I really think that he could. I would kind of wish that he had done it honorably and he had just made the version that she wanted, but it, it was good. It was good all the same. I think that them reenacting some of the things was kind of an interesting turn, but again, I feel like it it still could have just been the guy talking, but the reenactments were fun. Coach McGurk is always a good time. Love the mom. Love the coach. Um, there was just the beauty of this show, and I'll tell you what the beauty of the show is for me personally, as a lot of this the episodes you see me just laughing, but it's nine times out of ten because of the one-liners, like the things that you catch them say just out of nowhere. It's not even necessarily the story or the the characters, what they're saying is funny. It's just like the one-liners that they kind of just throw in there and that randomly just ca caught me off guard. It's it's always a good time. But I really enjoyed that. I hope you guys did too. I know you guys are loving the home movies series, and I'm so glad. Um, I'm sorry this episode is coming out so late. I am trying to kind of keep the rhythm going of trying to watch uh, the shows and be continuing the shows that I have uh, been watching more often. And, um, you know, I, I'm i loving the series. And I also have the next episode already in the works because I accidentally recorded that one before I did this one. So I hope you guys enjoyed. And if you did, be sure to leave a like on the video. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you for staying awesome. And until next time, guys, bye.